Hey guys, um, a different angle that I'm trying again. So, uh, this is the look that I did today. I wanted to do a holiday look without doing like um, red and green. So, this is probably going to be what I end up wearing for Christmas Eve at least for work. Um, oh, it's not focusing. <laughs> Maybe it's a bad angle because now it's going to focus on all that crap in the background. But anyway, um, I just did gold and green. I was playing around with the black palette. So that's what the gold and one of the greens are from. So it's really quick and simple. And I'm just going to do start it now. Um, I'm going to prime my lid with the Kat Von D primer. The first color I'm going to use is Cobra, the um, really dark gold from the black palette on just a regular e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. And I'm going to just pack it on the lid. You don't have to be too neat with it because we're going to blend it out. Um, I packed it on just because it's got some like gold glitter in it and I want that to show up. I don't want to blend it all away. Um, so then I'm going to grab this color which is Envy. It's one of the Wet n Wild single colors. It's this green. And I'm going to grab a crease brush. This is one of the Sonia Kashuk ones. And I'm going to load up with this green and just put it in my crease. Starting at the outer corner. And bring it all the way in. And I'm also going to take a pencil, well, not a pencil brush, but this little smudger brush. It's one of the Sonia Kashuk ones from, I can never remember if it was Into the Woods or Out of the Woods, that collection with the wooden handles. And I'm going to um, connect it on the outer corner and line my lower lash line with it. The outer corner of this eye is watering, so it's probably not going to stick. So that looks like that. Um, Alright, so that's it for that green. And then I'm going to go back to the black palette and use the green in here, which is called Libertine. This super blackish green. Ignore my nails, I painted them and then didn't wait long enough for them to dry and now they're all nicked. Um, stop watering. Back to the crease brush in that libertine color. And this is just going to go in the crease again to darken it up. Alright, for a highlight color, I'm using um, Brulee. It's another Wet n Wild color. And this is like my new favorite highlighting brush. I know I always use that little fluffy one, but this is from the Sonia Cat. Uh, Sonia Kashik. Um, collection of pink brush brushes that they had in October for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and it's really stiff, so it blends um, like the outer edges really well. So I'm just going to grab some of that on this brush and blend out the edges. I'm going to take the CoverGirl Liquiline Blast. This is the black one. I'm going to line the waterline and the upper lash line with this. All right, and then once I have my liner on, I'm going to use, I'm actually using two um, glitter liners that are pretty similar, um, the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Liner in Stage Dive, which is a pretty aqua green, and then, oop, the NYX um, Jade one, and they're only like a shade off from each other. But the NYX one actually works a little bit better than the Urban Decay one, which this one's like 18 bucks and the NYX one's only 6 I think. Which is crazy to me, but um, I really like the color of the Urban Decay one, so I'm just going to do a layer of the Urban Decay one over the black liner on the top. And then I'm going to put a layer of the NYX one over it, just to give it a couple different green colors of glitter. 
I might. And then I happen to mention we need guarantee on time. All right, and then um, mascara. I'm just using Maybelline's Define a Lash. And um, for lips, I'm just gonna do a gloss. If I can open this little palette thing. Um, this is just a silly, silly, city color lip palette that I got in a, like, a Christmas set. Got some pretty colors in it. They all smell like vanilla. They smell really good. Um, where's my lip brush? I don't know where it is. I'll just use the brush that comes with this. Uh, I'm gonna use this color on the end that already has a gouge taken out of it because I like it. <laughs> the um, lip gloss doesn't add a lot of color, it just gives it some shine. And it's a little bit shimmery, so. Um, that is the look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, like I said, it's really quick and easy. Um, kind of a dark, dramatic holiday look, but I like it, so um, I'm going to stick in some pictures and I'll talk to you guys later.